Hello everybody and welcome back to some more of the new save file. We are on an absolute roll now for the streaks, but it is probably challenge time. We haven't done some challenges in a little while here. Uh, there's a lot of stuff to get here, so I don't know what to go for first. Um, I do, like, although the, re the reward from it isn't that good, I do really enjoy the speed challenge. It's one that's very, very difficult. Um, but... Yeah, let's do speed. Speed is just a challenge that I find a lot of fun. It's not a great unlock, but yeah, it's just basically the idea of everything being mega sped up. On Fiend Folio, I honestly don't know how this is going to work. We're probably going to have quite a few deaths. I mean, I've already been hit by a champion there. That's great. And of course, his bloody half soul heart fell somewhere where I can't grab it. Damn you. Uh, there isn't item rooms on this, I don't think. Oh, no, no, there is, isn't there? There is. I'm... I'm yeah, there is. Okay. I was gonna say, this is even be impossible if there wasn't item rooms. I just, I, I really like it. The, I think it's 16 minutes you have to beat the run in. Um, it's pretty darn tough, but it's not impossible. Getting speedball is actually a pretty good uh, grab for us here. Being able to speed ourselves up some. Right. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I, I, I don't know. I just, I'm, a, I'm big into speedrunning, so I really enjoy anything that forces you to go fast. And speedball is definitely good for this, god damn it. Uh, but yeah, it's speeding up the animations of things. I've never done this on Fiend Folio, so I'm sure it's going to cause some issues and some rooms are going to be real heckin' difficult, I'm sure. Uh, but <laughs> we'll just have to see how it goes. Um, but yeah, um, in terms of uh, the question of the day, it's got to be something speed related, hasn't it? Um, when was the last time you did speed the drug? No, I'm joking. Um, <laughs> I don't know. What what would be a good one? Um, hmm. What's your like go to motivator? What's something that can get you working fast and get you really focused? What's your thing that you do to like get yourself really in the mood to uh, to speed yourself up on a task or something? Because Hey, for me, it used to be caffeine, but I've I've since sworn off of caffeine, as many of you know. I can't believe I just accidentally used a fucking key there. That was so dumb. I, you watch, I'm not able to get to my item room now. Um, For me, it used to be caffeine, but now I don't really have a particular thing. I think, for me, like, it's more so about, like, preparation for what's ahead than anything else. Like, if I know something's coming and I can kind of get me, myself mentally prepared for it, then I'm really up for it. Especially if it's like stupid stuff like just like cleaning the house and stuff. I know that sounds really dumb to have to prepare for that sort of stuff. But if I like, if, if I just get like the sporadic need to clean, like the girlfriend's like, oh, the house is a tip, you have to clean it. I'm like, oh, fuck's sake. But then if I like wake up, the like if, if, I, if I know I'm going to clean the previous day and I wake up, I'm so into it. I can get be so ready. I'll put a podcast on, just get really into it. Oh, God. We might have to have a few attempts at this, by the way, as well. Like, we might end up making it to Mum's heart and not get the, uh... Not get the 16 minutes. Damn it, I wish I'd left the Tinted Rock there now, because I could have bombed you. Oh my god. He is hitting me pretty hard. It's okay, though. We've, we've actually gained quite a lot of health over this. But yeah, I don't know if anyone else is like that, where, like, the mental preparation is, like, sort of half the battle. I will check the devil deal here, because we could get some stuff that majorly speeds us up, like that. Right. Let's go. Yeah, th this is going to take a few attempts, I think. I want to get my item room. I realise I'm wasting time here, but if it's, like, Polyphemus or something, or, like, 2020, it could speed us up drastically, so... I feel like I have to. Oh my god. Honestly, anything that dashes towards you is so difficult to manage. The wafer, while it's not insanely good now, later on that could be very, very impactful. So, glad, glad I went back and got it. Right. We have 12 minutes left to do the rest of the floors. We've already taken a bit too long, to be honest, on these two floors. For the next few floors, we have to speed up, but... Getting either the occult such should speed us up a good amount, um, I would think. But yeah, now we don't have to worry about champions dealing crazy damage to us as much, which is nice. Oh my god, there's creep there. Oh my god, I'm, almost, yeah, I'm already dead. <laughs> I'll be honest, I didn't even see that creep. Like, well, I, I, no, I did. I just didn't register that it'd deal damage to me. 
Um, rather annoying room here. The pale is actually pretty good. Uh, allows us to get into secret rooms easily and stuff like that. I like... Oh my god. Certain enemies here are going to be an absolute pain, aren't they? Anything that, that upchucks shots or dashes towards us. And this guy does both. Good, good. Oh my god, this thing's insane. This thing plus speed is not fun. Um, three random hearts is pretty good. We'll take that. And then turns all pickups in, into pills. Oh, damn. Everything into pills? That could be nutty. I will save that for a room in which is deserving of it. Really? You had to dodge my bomb there? You had to go for a little... Okay, unfortunately we're getting Cuba meat here, which obviously isn't good. I'd much prefer something that's offensive or that gives us some movement speed. But yeah, the speed challenge, it just gets you kind of like on edge, doesn't it? It kind of just adds stress to your day, but in, in like a kind of a good way. I really like speedrunning. Speedrunning is just so much fun. I know this isn't, it isn't traditional speedrunning. It's like a forced speedrunning, but I still really enjoy it. Speedrunning is just one of those things. I always enjoy watching it. I mean, those of you that, that know already, I did some speedrunning of like Doom Eternal. I've done some Enter the Gungeon speedrunning. It's really fun how like different games have su such vastly different ways of speedrunning based on like bugs and glitches, like, or based on like Enter the Gungeon's very, like, not very glitch heavy at all. It's more about um, like specific knowledge of how the game generates rooms and generates flaws. Uh, if you can learn that, learn the, like, the methodology to how the game generates things it's really easy to predict what floor type you're on and therefore predict where the boss could be it's not like a, a defined guaranteed sort of result you're not always going to get it right but it's pretty it's pretty consistent okay enemies like this just fuck me up right item room we need you still ace of cups is not the one yet oh my god Chastity isn't very good for us, but we're not holding any keys right now, so I will take it. it. Gives us plus two damage for now, which is decent enough. Right. We got Tech Pin. I haven't fought Tech Pin in ages, I'll be honest. Aw, oh, you scrounging little bastard. Get out the fucking ground. What are you doing? You alright there, Tech Pin? You wanna pop up? No, not interested. Nope, okay, restart. <laughs> Tech Pin soft lock, never had that before. A little bit bizarre. Little bit strange, but such is the way of the Binding of Isaac modded. Sometimes you're gonna get some stuff that you can't particularly explain. Sometimes it's gonna happen. Okay, don't throw your little roly heads towards me and expect me to forgive you, because I won't. Dun, 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 dun. We need to fire right up. Little Minx is actually dog shit. I really don't like Little Minx at all. I'd, it's a quality three, but I just don't get what it does. It possesses enemies, and then that, that's kind of it. Like, like, what what has that done for, for me, for that enemy? Nothing, really. I don't know. Maybe it lowers the HP? I really don't know. It just doesn't seem to do anything. So can anyone point out what the hell it does? Because I, I... I mean, I'm sure reading the description would help, but... I ain't reading. Ooh, we lost a lot of damage from that there. A lot of damage. That gives you a damage multiplier, but a damage down. So actually lost a lot of damage on that. Okay, Devil's Box just doesn't work. Okay, this is another failed attempt. Right, we gotta get a good start here. 
Flush is actually pretty good because we can clear out big rooms instantly. I can't believe Flush is quality one, I'll be honest. Like, rooms like this, nah thanks. I mean, then you could destroy the poops as well to get some stuff. It's pretty good. Oh, you've uh, fallen, you can't get up. But yeah, anytime there's a room with a lot of enemies, well, once every four rooms at least, this should have been our flush room, really. Oh my god, I literally sidestepped into both of those. Are you kidding me? This is a hard room. Eternal Heart should not have picked that up yet. Yep, it's gone already. <laughs> oh my god, it's so hard to not get hit. But speed is life. And if we get Dingle here, we get an instant boss kill too. Damn it. We got Shiny Monstro. That's going to kill us. Oh, definitely. Yep, we're dead. <laughs> oh, speed. You are beautiful. Nope. I'm not going to restart all the time on our first item. But if we get an item that is, that is clearly just not good for us at all, then I am going to take a pass on it. I don't want this to be too long of a video of us just restarting. I do want to actually try and get this challenge over and done with this video because it is a rather hard challenge. Why do they always do that? Why do they always make a room like that with like really active combat and then put like a mulligan like sat there in the corner pissing itself? Like, just no. Just why bother? Oh my god. Just giving us all of the worst possible rooms here. All the rooms that take the longest. Of course, one of these guys has to be a champion as well. Do give us a half heart back. Honestly, Curse the Lost is probably the worst thing about this. No idea where I'm meant to be going. Have I gone the wrong way already? I don't know. Lemon juice, that's fine. That could be good. Not this floor, but later on could be good. Oh, but yes. It's been a speedy old day for me today. I've been doing a lot, a lot of stuff. A lot of work stuff's been going on. It's been kind of hectic. All sorts of nonsense going on. Tier game is awesome. Ooh, my Tursus. Lovely. Grab that real quick. Excuse me, one of those shots hit me. How? I'll accept it, but I'm not happy about it. Ah, Troll Bomb, why? Oh, God. We have to fight the boss with this setup. Tier game be damned. Although it seems like we have... Uh, Brainworm with it too, apparently. That's pretty good. Okay, down we go. Synthoil, really good. Okay, this is this is our best attempt so far. We've got some good stuff going on here. In fact, so good that I can just skip that room. If I get explosive tears like this, I can skip rooms, so... Pretty good. But basically, tier game, every time we get a kill, it switches that tier effect. Magic Fingers is incredible for us as well. Holy shit, that's so good. We need a lot of money to, to make it work. But it's so good, because we can just do that. Three more mini Isaacs, hell yes. But yeah, if a, room, if a room looks viable for us to skip, then we can. Why can't I, like I, say, why can't I pick up that burn heart? Okay, nice one. We got bomb tears for the boss as well. Lovely. That's what we like to see. Oh god, no. We somehow got Akeldama tears. Where did they come from? I literally don't know how we got those. We didn't kill anything. Unless a mini Isaac died and that counted. Akeldama tears is the worst one you can get. Lemonhead's good here. Um, neither of those are worth grabbing. Down we go. Okay, this is, this is speedy so far. This is speedy. I like this. I like the speed. That's a good room, but I don't care. Just gotta be aware of what tier effect we get each each time. A lot of weird ones we can get. Soul of Isaac spin wheel. I'm, I'm gonna re-roll that because I'm just not gonna end up utilizing that very well. 
Can you fucking... Oh my god. Right. We got a soul of Isaac, so I'm going to re-roll that. Oh, wait a minute. Speed up, really good. Love that. Petrified Poop's really good too here. Potentially more money coming in. I like that. Do, 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 do. Rubber Cement this time around. Yeah, tier game's just wacky and fun. It's just... It's just so crazy. I love it. Let me get a Soul of Judas as well here. Why not? I'll use that on the boss, I guess. Good, good. Sadly, didn't get any of those bombs. Poops didn't give us anything there either, really. Lovely. We just need way more money coming in. Way more money. That's all I'm asking for. Just give us some sort of infinite source of money, please. Oh, we got teleport tiers. Pain in the ass. Oh, we got the magnet tiers here. Which means we can use bombs very effectively. Ow. That was really hard to avoid, good sir. Holy shit, this guy's tricky. Oh my god, this guy's very, very tricky with speed. We're getting through him. The lemon tier didn't help. The, le the lemon head for the really small tiers, but... Hey, her. I was going to use the, the Soul of Judas here, but I forgot. Oh my god, walk right over that as well. Staples are awesome here. Sin robes will take. We're good to go. Oh my god, this is... This is scary. Oh, we got fucking teleporty tears again. Fuck the teleporty tears. Very, very annoying. There's some tear effects that are just an absolute pain in the ass. Some of them are ace. Others, not so much. Oh, what the hell? He double dashes. I didn't know he double dashed. Do I really want to use a penny to get in here? Honestly, the answer was not really. Um, bomb you. She got a pill, goddammit. Doesn't really matter. Sadly, all the wrong way so far. This is a good solo Judas moment, though, once we get in double split. Oh, we got Akeldama again, fuck's sake. The worst. And I got Akeldama again, fuck's sake, go away. Um. Yes, that's good, that's good, that's good. It would be easier to hit things with Spectral and the extra fire rip. Should be overall good. Oh, really? There's Hurst in here. Didn't hit. I used a penny, didn't hit anything. It's very annoying. Can you pop up, please, you shit? Oh my god. Losing health way more rapidly than I should be. Typeset's good here. I like that. Typeset basically applies the um, broken murder effect sometimes to enemies. Whatever the split shot is, this is good shit. Don't care about the shop right now. Could definitely do with some more HP. Okay. Good, good. Oh god, these guys are moving around too much. Had to just kill them like that. Oh my god, the stress is just unbelievable. Oh, really? That was such a good direct hit, dude. He's hit me a lot now. God damn it. Another really good item. We've got some really banger boss items so far here. But I'm, I'm very worried about my current HP, though. Current HP is definitely an issue. Oh, Akel Dharma, you stupid. It's dumb. I don't like it. Oh, 
Why'd you give me a chest? Do you know what, what, what am I doing? Why am I fighting those? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yes, that's exactly what I was hoping for. That's the exact result I wanted. I know this is an extra room that we have no real value in doing, but seeing an old chest there, I had to try it. And then we've got the ability to push these together and see what we get. Which is exactly what I was hoping for again, just way more money. Good, good, good. Basically, any room that's like, looks easy, just use a bit of that. Honestly, this floor, I think we're skipping item room. Oh, we got annoying fucking Monstro 2. This version of Monstro 2 is a pain in the ass. Oh my god, yeah, because he doesn't actually fire Brimstone, he fires spiders, and I always forget that. But then sometimes he does fire Brimstone, what the hell? You weird fella, stop! Death's Touch is actually really good here. I know it's a massive risk, but it's a massive tier size up and it's piercing. It could be incredible. Okay. Good old hot bombs. Pretty good for extra bombs, thank you. You're annoying. Shock disc, just pop it. Black lantern, a few other things. Night light and something else, I don't know. Dr. Fetus is, um... I don't think Dr. Fetus is worth it. It's such a good item, but... It even, and we even have hot bombs too, but... I think it's actually slower than what we currently have, you know. Weirdly enough. Okay, that's what I'm hoping for. More pennies. Good, good, good. Right. And away we go. There's two of you. Not too bad. There's some bombs there to grab. Quickly go grab those. Akeldama again, fuck you. Quickly get those bombs, they're pretty useful blowing random shit up. Good, good, good. What time we got left? We've got six minutes left. Uh, I guess I'll carry that with me. Okay, we got Fiend Mum, which isn't actually that bad. Come on, pop your pop your nubbins out a bit more, thank you. Really good. Good shit. Okay, health is fine now. Now we just gotta make it through the womb, which I think we can do basically solely with um with our fingers, whatever you wanna call it. When did we get flight by the way? Holy shit, that was a fast floor. What the hell? Yeah, when did we get flight? We don't have flight anymore, apparently. Oh, dude, come on now. Hit with the spikes twice in a row. Can you not? Can you not, sir? God damn, that room could have been really annoying. Oh, this is a hard room. Oh, those enemies are bullshit. Fuck you. Not even going the right way, god damn it. There's a lot more money, good. We're gonna have to rely on money for most of this, I think. We got four minutes. So we got plenty of time. Time is time is not a problem right now. It's our health that's a problem.
Health is currently the issue. Lots of flies and spiders and stuff, that's good. We don't need to use coins done, oh for fuck's sake. Should not have been hit there. Soul heart there. Grab that real quick. Ah, oh, for... Getting hit by some top tier bullshit right now. Yes! And that's how it's fucking done, people. That is how you do speed. My goodness, that was a lot of fun. Oh, that was a that was a tricky one. That really was. That was a tricky one. Um, I'm just vetting. What, what, that lasted a little longer than I thought, but I'm vetting if we can get another one in. Is it the thing? Is I don't know which ones go to Mum's foot. Does this one go to Mum's foot? It does, okay. We can try we can try do this one real quick. And life gives you lemons. Oh you telepilled off of it, you bitch. That made things a little easier. Look down. Heck. Come, step right into the pool. Yeah, this this really should give you lemon mishap now. Now, uh, not lemon mishap, sorry. Yeah, free lemonade. Now the free lemonade's a thing, rather than lemon mishap. I mean, at least we can use it once per room. That is nice, but... Goddamn, the game feels so fucking slow now. Holy shit. Like, unbelievably slow. It's kind of crazy. There's no item rooms on this one, I don't think. I'm just going to take my leave. Put it here and hope for the best. In fact, just lemon party. I can't be asked. Should get one of those pills per floor. Sadly, we only get the one. Yeah, I'm fairly sure there's no item rooms. I might have just missed out on one there. And sadly, this challenge comes to a quick halt because of shit like this. Oh, don't you dare. Okay, thank you. Unfortunately, it turned two of those dudes into super champions and they have... So much health. And also, they've nicely aligned themselves above some rocks for us. And they probably won't move from that position. Okay, we've actually got them out of it. But yeah, these guys have a lot of health now because of that fucking stupid champion. We're not on a time limit for this one, so it's not as bad. But I still would rather it not be take us too long to do this. Considering a fly is taking like 10 shots to kill. Put things to sleep, apparently. Melatonin. Not really what I was looking for, but thank you. I suppose it's the best thing we can spend keys on, really, at the moment. Get out of here. Chance when you pick up a coin uh, to... Okay, that's pretty good, actually. I will take. I will take. Not that we need the golden key, but I'll grab it anyways. Oh, come on, you stopped, like, right in front of it. That was a bit of a bust, wasn't it? Like, hardly any damage off of that. God damn, the game just feels so slow. It's so weird. Like I'm playing in slow motion. Kind of weird that it's actually a nun's habit as well. I get it means that you get to use your active more, but... Like, I don't want to get hit to use Lemon Mishap more. That seems just kind of dog shit. Extra HP here. Um, honestly, take both of these. Both of these will speed things up drastically, I think. Although, I'm pretty sure these orbs are meant to chase enemies, and then they, was they wasn't, so... I guess we'll see if the AI on this guy's a little bit busted. Oh, 
Okay, no, it's it, it chases an enemy and then it bonks off them. I see. I see how it works. Got two things that go directly for enemies. Should be a good amount of extra damage for us. I don't know if these guys touch the floor, so I'm not going to bother using one in this app. It looks like they fly in just, just the way that they hover around the room. Yeah, th these two familiars were great pickups here. Well, that's a lot of keys. Wow. Again, don't really need keys on this run, but thank you regardless. Okay, you do your thing. Good, good. Um, potentially better? I don't know. I'll see. We'll find out. You're not that big of an issue. Damn it, we got no money for shops as well at the minute. Oh, we got one of the invincible dudes. Again, don't think... Oh god, they... I did not realise that they generated split shots when they threw keys. That's new to me. Good. Bombs are always going to be good for us. Okay, we'll see how quickly we can kill this guy. Ah, he sucks all the orbs towards him. It's not a good idea, Mr. Dude. It's not a good idea. It's just dealing more damage to yourself. My good sir. You are a fat boy taking quite a lot of damage, but... We're getting you down. We're getting you down. There you go. Good, 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 good. More range is okay. I, really, I just want damage and speed. That's all I care about. Damage and speed. Sadly, this is not really the easiest of runes, but these guys can be pushed directly into the fire. Kind of interesting one. Um, nah, I don't think so. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm not really using Limb and Mishap all that, uh, all that well right now, I realise. But honestly, it's just not a good active, really. It's such a small um, area of effect that it's really hard to make good use out of, to be honest. If I had more bombs, I'd go for some soul hearts there, but unfortunately I do not. Oh, we got one of those chests. I don't think we need one of those right now, but I, we can't even afford to open it, to be honest. So whether we needed it or not doesn't matter, because we can't afford to open it. Oh, God, stay away. Honestly, these little dudes, they're killing it. They're killing it. Don't diss on Rotten Baby or Tiny Horn. Don't really care about losing my Devil Deal. Again, I don't really have the health to play it, so I am, I am, I am. Damn it. Should have known this was the wrong way. It's fine, it's fine. It's always through the bigger rooms. Okay, we've got two of these guys. Slightly annoying. Oh, they both died very quickly though, so that's fine. Holy hell. I'm I'm still like on an adrenaline rush from playing the uh playing the speed challenge, honestly. That challenge is so much fun. I know some people really hate it and find it really tricky, especially people like I remember my friend Never Named saying that he finds it really, really difficult. He's a very methodical, slow player. So it just doesn't vibe with how he plays the game. But for me, oh, it's just, it just works. It's just, it basically is exactly how I already play. This is ridiculous. This boss is such a mess. Someone needs to contact the authorities and report whoever designed that, that boss, because they need to go to jail. They need to be sent somewhere, because that is just not okay. We actually got some more damage now, though, which is beautiful. Unfortunately, it was only damage. We didn't get speed as well or anything like that. But we should at least be able to move on reasonably quickly here. Ow. Crazy how quickly two little fellas can carry through a run. 
Just another thing about this challenge, just so many things fly. So many things are immune to creep damage that it's just makes this challenge just stupid. It's just everything can dodge you. Come on. There's just spider traps everywhere. Also, these guys are completely misaligned. They fire way before their head comes up. Okay, it's always through the big room. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hey, that wasn't too bad. Ah, oh, bugger, I was wrong. This time it wasn't through the big room. Another room full of enemies that we can't use on a mishap on there. Lovely. I can't believe we're surviving on the HP we have, though. Like, we're just kind of crushing it. Oh, and we're just never getting soul hearts. Apparently, they're just frowned upon in this game. Don't know what's going on in here. Don't have the time or care. We'll pull this guy out a little bit, see what he can give us. We have no need for the keys he's, he's plopping out, so... It's actually a better penny trinket, so I'll take that. And then he just gives us the trinket. That's such an annoying payout from him. It's such a bad pay- Oh, dude. You need to calm down, fellas. Amnesia? Fuck's sake. I don't need to double my money, I don't care. Ow. Okay, we might be in trouble here. And by in trouble, I mean we might actually die on what is normally a very, very easy challenge. Does anyone remember where my shop was? I really like this enemy design. It's really cool. I wish I had my map to find out because that would be super useful right about now. Right. Double our money now. Two of diamonds. Not very useful, but there you go. See if we can find our shop real quick. Not through here. Okay, where is it? Thing is, I don't know where we have and haven't been, so I'm a little wary. Not a secret room? Wow. Damn it, I, I don't think we've seen the shop this floor. I'm pretty sure anywhere we go is going to be new. Okay. Time to focus up, I guess. Okay, okay, okay. We can, we can get this. That has at least put me in a position of being a lot more happy about where we stand. And so is that. Okay, I'm fine now. I don't care now. That one room saved all of our troubles. All of our troubles are gone. Right, back the way we came. Which I don't remember. I think it's this way. Nope. It's up and then left. Goddamn amnesia, you bitch. You bitch, amnesia. Okay, found our boss. It's good, sir. I don't actually know this boss very well, so I don't know how difficult he really is. He doesn't seem all that bad, but I, I don't want to speak too soon. Oh, fuck. Okay, no, 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 no. He's horrible. He's horrible. That is awful. This is bad. Holy shit, this guy is... I thought this guy would be okay. He is not okay. Repeat, not okay. I'm having a very hard time. I'm gonna die. I'm going to die against this guy. Stop shooting out shithead kids on me. Oh, dude. Dude. That is a very tough boss. Wow. And also, thank you, Lemon Mishap, for being so useful. Wowee, you're so good, Lemon Mishap. 
You're so good. You helped me so much in that fight. If only you did anything. Fuck's sake. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this run nonetheless, and I'll see you guys in the next one.